Voltei! Voltei! Can I get over there somehow? Is that another puppy? There's that dirty RV from the other day. Bobby! Stop that! Stop! No barking. Oh, I can't pet the puppy. There was something pet... creepy about that guy and his dog. Oh man. I wanted to pet the puppy. He's so cute! Anyway. Chloe's been waiting for me. <laughs> Man, that smell of breakfast and... Good lord. Talk about apocalyptic. Wait, what is it? Good lord. Talk about apocalyptic. Invites you to live within the... Okay. Okay. <laughs> Prescott Development invites you to live within the woods. This is basically just setting up for Slender the Arrival. <laughs> what? Then I made the possible, possibly fatal decision to inform the Principal Wells. Oh. I should sit down inside and wait for Chloe. What's the latest one? Ah, okay. Guitar zoom. Well, I can't change it to the other one, huh? Whoa, can Kizzy with Joyce? That's so perfect. The Wall of Fame. <laughs> Forgot about the fishing wall of fame. Everything. <laughs> Not yet. I want to talk to people first. Trucker! Uh, hello? Pardon moi, but you're in my eyesight. Isn't everything in here with an eyesight? I don't care for your tone. It's you sound point. like Joyce. How does Joyce sound? Bossy and smartass. Like you. Joyce rules. I want to be exactly like her when I grow up. No. Looks like you're on your way. No. I've been coming to this dive for three years, and Joyce gives me shit like it's going out of style. That's how she rolls. That's why I worship her every move. Good. I can't wait to see you flipping greasy bacon in a diner when you grow up. Exactly like Joyce. Now pardon me while I get back to my coffee. And I will probably eat that bacon in your face. I don't bacon feel like is amazing. Right now. I gotta deliver a load of breakfast to my stomach. No camper. Ah. Hello, sir. Hi, young lady. You look a little lost. <laughs> Just hungry and thinking about what to eat. Now that is a real problem at the uh, two wells. I can never decide. Joyce's pumpkin pie or grilled mac and cheese. Mm. So, you know Chloe? Sadly, we all know Chloe down at the station. <sighs> Poor Joyce. She just heard she even just got busted with pot in her room. <laughs> uh, who told you that? I didn't hear it on the police scan. Joyce said the weed belonged to Chloe's friend, but I highly doubt that. Joyce didn't tell you who? She wouldn't. Afraid I'd go arrest somebody, as if I would. <laughs> I'd just tell the loser to stay the hell away from Chloe, or else. I'm <laughs> just kidding. Besides, David Madsen's watching me. 
Is she a friend of yours? I know her. Then you know she's a handful. She can be, but she can also be a good friend who shows up when you need her. Sounds like you're a good friend. I wish she would be a great daughter and not cause Joy so much stress. Jesus, dude. How well do you know Joyce? I know her delicious grub. Everybody at the station comes here. We take care of this place like it's our own kitchen. And Joyce, like she's our... our mother. I guess you're friends with David Madsen. I wouldn't use that word. We know each other. Why do you ask? Well, this guy just entered the realm of creepy. He kind of has a reputation at Blackwell. I have respect for David. He served his country. He found his calling at Blackwell. At the station, we're happy David is exactly where he is. <laughs> Not everybody can be a cop. I have to go now. Enjoy your breakfast. By the way, one thing I can tell you for certain is to stay away from that RV outside. I usually stay away from sketchy parked vehicles. Wise policy. The guy who lives in it, Frank, is pretty sketchy himself. That's all I can say for now. I should finish up my coffee and get to work. Why would you say that? <laughs> Dude. What do you want? I feel like shit. Too much beer. So spare me, please. Just let me suffer quietly. <laughs> okay, that's pretty funny. That graffiti has been here forever. Still, why would a cop say Gross. that? Framing! Ha! Uh, pun. Oh yeah, that reminds me, I gotta get it. Frame. For my senior project. But yeah. Thank you, redneck poet. <laughs> I might make Chloe check this out with me. <laughs> Sasquatch future. Why does that so not sound fun? <laughs> this guy has serious cojones. Oh, man, I bet that's the same gum from when I was here last. Nah. I always wonder what people think about when they eat alone. Hello there to you! Such a beautiful day, eh? Oh, yeah, it's gonna be a super day. Enjoy your breakfast, eh? Oh, my God, she's Canadian! Run away! Did you catch any big <laughs> ones today? If by big you mean none, then sure. I caught a lot of big ones today. Now let me mourn over my eggs. Wow. Depressing. <laughs> hey, Trevor. Holla, Max. By the way, I know you saw me in the dorm. Yeah, I saw you coming out of Dana's room. Yeah, and I finally had to tell Justin because, well, he was into her too. How did Justin react? I got him blazed. He was cool. Nobody has secrets in Blackwell anyway. See in class, Max. What's yeah, it's up, clearly Justin? people at Blackwell don't have any secrets I cut whatsoever. Class and destroy some rails. Shouldn't you be taking photos? I am always taking photos. I am a camera. You cracked me up, Maxer. Of course I'm baked. So I'll laugh at anything. You should be studying, bad boy. So where's all your homework, schoolgirl? School? Speaking of buds, I saw your bro Trevor sneaking out of Dana's room. Trevor finally told me about him and Dana hooking up. He got there first, so I snooze and I lose. See you later, Max. Well, 
flirting, kind of flirting with a Blaze dude. My work here is done, <laughs> I guess. Whoa. And there she is. Lovely young woman. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. It's nice to see you again. You look the same. <laughs> like I'm still a waitress at Two Whales after all these years. No, like you still look pretty. Uh, nice save, kid. You're still smart. But I wish you'd been here to help save Chloe. She got busted yesterday smoking out. Again. I know. Chloe told me that her stepfather hit her. I am sorry that was your introduction to David. I hope you get to know him on your terms, not Chloe's. He's a good man. He just... Yeah, I'm sure he is since you married him, but... Don't be so harsh on Chloe. He's just it's really American. <laughs> I was hoping you could be a good influence in her life now. I will be. Promise. I know things were hard for you. If I fuck up, I can just go back in time I and redo it. I didn't call. Now my gotcha folks cover, are in Joyce. Seattle and I'm all alone at Blackwell. It's my karma. You did the right thing. You moved forward with your life. I did after William passed on. Chloe? Chloe chose to stay angry. Anyway, I hope we see more of you. Chloe needs an old friend again. Joyce, I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. I'm glad, Max. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Even if Chloe doesn't understand yet. Chloe understands. She just needs time. I know that sucks for you. Oh, she hit all the phases. Expulsion, running away, drugs, bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair. <laughs> now she's got to rebel against her stepfather. I see why, I mean. Why? What did Chloe tell you? She Chloe didn't doesn't tell have me to anything. tell me anything. I just know how David is at Blackwell. You know what happened. David slapped Chloe. He fucked up. But Chloe does push David, and it's not fair. He paid his dues in a war. He does care about her, along with all the students at Blackwell. That's no excuse to hit her. <laughs> that's no excuse to hit a girl. He's an adult. I don't like no, that. No, that's not even an David excuse, swore period. It would never happen again. He's true to his word. I just want us to be a family soon, I guess. I guess it's all about time. I think you're right, Joyce. So, now let's get down to the nitty gritty. What do you want to eat? Hmm. Bacon. I was First word, bacon. bacon Second word, I want now bacon. Finish your coffee. Even though those aren't words. Those are words. Words. Bacon. <laughs> bacon. <laughs> Baking good. One bacon omelet for the young. The only thing that's changed on the menu are the prices. Holy fuck. Latest app. Bacon at 12 o'clock high. I love well, uh, the delicious anticipation of breakfast. This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. Right. I keep What's going up, back folks? in time. How's it going? Welcome to Gaming Circle Live, Gamer Circle Live. We're doing episode two of Life this is Strange. This looks so mysterious. I wish I could stay in this moment forever. I guess I actually can now. But then it wouldn't be a moment. Order ready. Mm. Graffiti. No beer. Uh, what what kind of graffiti? Warren must have been here. <laughs> Incoming. I can hear your stomach rumbling from here, Max. Here, you'll love this. Thank you. I'm drooling like a baby. Still can't believe you're a woman. I had a and I look at today. pictures of Chloe. Oh. I went my dentist. Uh, my jaw kind of hurts at the moment. Mm -hmm. Speak of the devil. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Mom and Max, together again. And Chloe looking for a free meal. You put your whole damn college fund on your tab. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. No, you're not. This is my treat to you for coming back to rescue my daughter. Nobody needs to rescue me. Wow. Unless Make you set your room obvious. on fire smoking out. Oh, God, here it comes. Didn't you and Sergeant Pepper already read me the riot act last night? Call him <laughs> David if you don't want to be lectured. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. Joyce, you this is not the place. <laughs> Another reason to blow this town? What is this shit on the jukebox? <laughs> now that that's out of the way. Hmm. Let's talk about your superpower. I don't have any explanation, and I can't explain why I saw that crazy fucking tornado. Come on, that's just a daydream. I want proof you can rewind time. This is all happening so fast. <laughs> we'll start slow. Right here, now. Mm, I can tell you every single thing you have in your pockets. You have x-ray vision, dude? I don't even know what's in my pockets. <laughs> Let me see. Okay, Max. Impress me. Keys. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. Hmm. Bullet. A bullet. Just like your necklace. That was so wrong, Max. Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. Okay. That was Pegasus. beyond epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. What was it? Pack of cigs. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully and don't forget anything. Okay. Key with panda. Car. Obviously. Cigs. Gotcha. Money. And this is a warning ticket. Uh, out of parking bay, you're causing an obstruction thingy. Okay. Rewinding. Rewinding, rewinding. Da, 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 da. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So, this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. A parking sure. ticket. You know me well. But, what is the exact time I was busted? Fuck. 10.30... Four a.m. Booyah! Max can tell time. Uh, Even a broken clock is right twice a day. What does the hell that means? <laughs> I was right, I and I didn't even know. <laughs> yes, you Lucky guess. But how many cigarettes? Fuck. <laughs> Chat. <laughs> Seven. Seven cigarettes. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. Bang! Two in a row, and I didn't even know. <laughs> we'll do the keys because that's easy. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. Da. Panda. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Super Max. You do yeah. have that Irish luck, Caulfield. What else? Money, but I don't remember how much sense. How, how much? Clearly, I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? Was in twenty five. I remember a quarter being in there. I'll go with eighty six. Eighty six cents. That's right. Living large in Arcadia Bay. Bang! Oh yeah. And I didn't even know. Bang! <laughs> Who needs time when well, you can just guess? I literally just got chills all over my neck. You have powers. Take that crap off the table, Chloe. Sure, Mom. <laughs> How's the food, Max? Better than I remembered. Very good save. 
Man, I'm hungry like the wolf. Clearly. I'm freaking out about what just happened. You, you have to show me more. Something way cooler so I will believe you without any doubt. <laughs> I will predict the future. No way. Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. <laughs> Oops. Did you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. Uh, damn. Is that all? Sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. Ah uh, man. So what are you waiting for? Now I should rewind and tell Chloe everything that just happened. I'm going to predict four events that will happen in the next 30 seconds or so. Trevor drops his Trevor glass drops first. His glass and Justin makes fun of him. So what happens next? Uh... Yeah. The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio and he answers it. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Uh... Justin and Trevor fight and Joyce doesn't give a shit. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. No, wait, no, that's wrong. Rewind. God damn it. Uh, that the jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. I think I got one wrong. Can I rewind? Yeah, I'm gonna rewind one more time. <laughs> I'm going to predict. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, drops his mug. Yeah, that was it. The trucker drops his mug and Joyce rips him a new one. So, what happens next? Okay. Uh, I, uh, his apartment leaves, alert on the cops. And he answers. The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio and his partner in the car leaves without him. Well, yeah. let's just see how this goes down. Yep. Uh, uh, yeah. Justin and Trevor fight and Joyce beats them. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. Wait, she doesn't beat them. <laughs> uh, Jukebox looks crazy. And a fly lines on it. Butterfly lines on it. As the trucker plays a new song. As a butterfly lands on it. As a fly lands on it. As it as the trucker plays a new song. The sure. jukebox goes crazy as the trucker tries to play a new song. Pretty bizarro, Max. Wait, well, no, let's that's see not if true everything either. happens like you said. Okay. So I can't see a damn cockroach or butterfly, or whatever. Yeah, hi Joyce. Uh, Oops. Did you right? break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a oh, dick. You're so Latin, cool. Bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm yeah. finishing it. You are really whiffing this. Uh. <laughs> this is a sad day in Maxville. This is sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our happened? jukebox is headed for Daisy Jones's locker. Uh. So, what are you waiting for? Now I should rewind and tell Chloe everything that just happened. Okay. But I didn't see what happened to the jukebox. Okay, whatever. I'm okay. going to predict. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So... 
driver drops his mug. Trucker drops his mug. Yeah. The trucker drops his. So yep. what happens next? Yep. Uh. Put it on the cosmic radio, and he leaves. Uh, and his partner leaves. The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio, and he quickly exits the diner. Well, let's just see how this goes down. God damn it, that wasn't it. Ah, fuck. Justin and Trevor fight. And Joyce stops them, and Joyce does. Justin and Trevor are fighting, and Joyce breaks it up. Yeah, that one's it. It's getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. Uh, jukebox goes crazy, there's a cockroach, as a fly lands on it, we'll go with the fly. The jukebox goes crazy as a fly lands on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. I think I got one wrong. Hi. <laughs> Dude, did you right. break another cup? Really? No refill for you. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a I dick. think not, Don't slap Max. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. Yeah. Uh, uh. This is a sad day in Maxville. Oh, it was a cockroach. It was a cockroach. Okay. Do 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 do. I'm yep. going. Yeah yeah yeah. Okay. So. Trucker drops his mug. Yep. So what happens next? Okay. Um. He answers and he eats a plane. And his partner leaves. Learn the cop's radio. The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio and he answers it. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Fuck. Joy stops him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's getting good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. The pretty bizarro. Okay. I think I fucked up one. <laughs> Oops. Dude, did you right. break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a I think Don't not, slap Max. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking A. This is sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you- Okay, okay, okay. 